Several members of the union carried placard with inscriptions such as respect the principle of collective bargain, we say no to casualization of intellectual labor, and ASU is a protector of public institutions, among others. Speaking to newsmen shortly after the rally, Dr. Husseini Abdullahi, the branch secretary of the union, said the protest was to express displeasure on the decision of the government to pay union October salary on a pro rata basis. Well informed, all well meaning Nigeria here in Nigeria and those in the diaspora, the, the unfair treatment we receive from government, despite uh, the goodwill that we have demonstrated by suspending the strike, based on the court ruling and the intervention of the Speaker House of Representatives and other well meaning Nigerians. So we expect that government should also uh, respect and do its own part of obligation. He said the union do not know why the government took such a decision, stressing that the decision violates rules of engagement for academics. While responding to the cancellation of the session as suggested by some members during the special meeting, the secretary said the suggestion will also be part of their submission to the NAIC for deliberation. Well, today we, we have uh, convened a special Congress meeting and the rally, and then the Congress uh, resolved um, that yes, we have uh, suspended the strike, but the, we are going to communicate to National uh, for them to consider. He added that the condition of service for the academic staff differs from the mainstream civil service, stressing that academic staff were employed to teach, conduct research and community services. He said the union just stopped the teaching component during the strike, but to the dismay of the lecturers, we are not paid on the pro rata basis. He therefore described the pro rata salary as a crash mischief by the government and its agent toward cajoling the union to reconsider its stand. From Zaria, Abubakar Sadiq Muhammad.